All right, let's go chill. Minnesota is 2-0 and on the season, and they are sitting at the top of their division. Shane Wells has more from the team's home field in St. Paul. We found a good kind of wind chill at Seafoam Stadium in St. Paul. Pro Ultimate Disc League team here, and the season just got underway. We're with the co-owner, head coach, ex-player, GM, all the things. Ben Feldman, How's thanks for joining us. Yeah, thank you. you got some players out there. Yes, we do. the disc around a little bit, but let's just go to the basics. Explain how Ultimate Disc works. Ultimate is seven on seven. It's played on a football field, as you can see here at Seafoam Stadium in St. Paul, where we play. The way that you score in Ultimate is uh, having your teammate catch the disc in the end zone. The one catch is when you have the disc, you can't move. So it's it's a little bit like scoring in football. It's a single point. Uh, it's kind of movement like in soccer, where you're seeing the disc kind of bounce around on the field. And then uh, when you have it, you kind of pivot like in basketball. When you pick up your dribble, you can't, uh, you obviously can't move. So um, each goal goal is a, is a point when you catch in the end zone and it's 12 or 12 minute quarters, four quarters. That's kind of the, the overview of it. A lot of fast flying fun action. And you know, the unique thing about our sport is that in football, when you have a big throw going up, I say to like Justin Jefferson, right? It's really exciting for like three seconds and the anticipation will, in ultimate, that anticipation may be six, seven, eight, nine seconds because the disc floats, right? So yeah. uh, when the when a big throw goes off, there's a it's pretty exciting when you got one-on-one -on -one going deep and there's a big throw or a huck is what they call it in ultimate. But, I would say um, it kind of like floats longer, some of them yep. curve. You can so dive you can a little bit little easier. More with those yeah. running the routes. Yep. You can get Diving some good for ones. it because it floats. Uh, there's a lot of laying out and uh, and still, it's non-contact, but uh, still a lot of you know physicality in the game for, for sure. So. Absolutely. So in terms of training, did these athletes come from doing playing ultimate for a long time, or is it coming from other sports? How does it usually work? Yeah, I would say I'd say that's uh, as ultimate has grown. I think a lot of people who are engaged in performing like are starting earlier and earlier. You know, when a lot of these guys started, like they maybe played in high school. Now you have middle school leagues, right? So kids are starting earlier. Um, but a lot of the players on our team, whether you know, call it, they're fresh out of college or in college or in their late 20s, um, they did play other sports prior to coming to Ultimate. So they have an athletic background, maybe soccer, basketball, football. Um, but uh, all those aspects, just like I talked about, it's a little bit of every sport in, in theory. So what drew you to it? Uh, I mean, similarly, I was like, I was, I did track in, in high school. I started playing actually, I went to Hopkins High School and uh, we had a big program at the time and I had someone drag me to the first trial, like what is ultimate? You know, people played at sub summer camp and, sure. uh, you know, started my sophomore year and, uh, you know, three years later made junior worlds and played in college and then started getting involved with pro. So my playing years are over uh, after about 15 to 20 years of playing. And still now, very I, involved, now I'm still very involved, uh, managing, coaching, owning, and uh, it's really rewarding to see you know some of these guys come up and be successful and train them and have see them get the this type of opportunity to play in front of a thousand fans. As Ben mentioned, a really fun fan experience as well, affordable for families too. Mark your calendars. The next home game is June 3rd. You can learn more at windchillultimate.com.